Hey guys, Adam with Master Paw. It's been a long time since I posted a video, so I just wanted to make this one, you know, really good for you guys. So, back in my office, let's let's talk. So, let's talk about like knowing. Like just because you guys watch YouTube videos, right? Or just because you read something in a book, or just because your dog did it without any distractions. That does not mean that your dog knows. Or that you know what at the end of the day that you know because you gotta you gotta like you have to practice yourself you have to you have to train yourself and ultimately your dog will follow and that's why dog trainers are so good because you know at the end of the day we've trained ourselves on how to train dogs so we already have years on you so you know don't think that everything needs to be done today tomorrow or that you really have a trained dog let me tell you what a trained dog is is listening to what you say regardless of treats and tools if your dog if your dog can do whatever you ask in any situation like any you know a pet store at the park you want to kick it up a notch a festival then your dog really knows. Now there's different levels of knowing, right? Just like there's different levels of karate and everything else. Just because, or you know, you, you gotta go as far as you want. Um, and just because some people wanna be a black belt or a master, that doesn't mean that you can't enjoy the, the sport or the activity. Because remember guys, dogs come to us for a reason it's our job to to find out what that reason is and mold it or develop it into the the potential that relationship that soul bond that that is possible and you know what is possible you guys have seen it you guys have seen it with diesel you guys have seen it with rocky especially rocky right even though diesel's just his train it's just that honestly guys i can't take him as many places I can but people look at him a little bit differently they'll cross the street or whatever because it's a pit bull because we're we're con we're, we're preconceived to believe that it's the dog guys it's not the dog it's genetics whether whatever dog you take if you take two fighting dogs and keep replicating them over and over then that's what you're gonna get it doesn't matter if it's a pit bull or a doberman or whatever you can't ban specific breeds. That doesn't make sense, right? But I see right here and right there. It's just the truth. So with Rocky, I'm able to go a lot further. And you guys see all these crazy things. Enjoy the ride. Enjoy the journey. Because there's ups and there's downs. Like as you start developing the puppy, they're really encouraged then you know then they they don't you know then they're hit with distractions and with growth with being an adult and then they stop listening to you it's your job to find out how you can talk dog every dog is different so you need to find a trainer a coach uh, a technique methods where you can follow along because all this stuff is basically out right Everybody's gonna have their flavor, and that's what you wanna, that's what you need, you know, a, a coach for is to, you know, take all the guesswork out and just tell me, all right, what do I need to do? A, B, and C. Because if you watch A, C, and Z, and that's how the dog trainer or the person that's showing you the video showed it, then you're skipping steps. And at the end of the day, again, guys, energy has a lot to do, to do with it. So, um, you know, if you're not trained, then, you know, you're going to go somewhere and you're going to start to be like, you're going to start to think to yourself, oh, no, there's another dog or there's a squirrel and you're going to feed the anxiety. So until you know that the dog is polished wherever, then it doesn't even affect you like subconsciously. Like you don't even believe it until you believe it, then then your dog will believe it. And that's that whole thing with, with doing it you know, every day or building consistency. You wanna give some days off because it's important to, to keep it different, guys. Don't train within four walls. Don't train within distractions, but train or you know at first and then get to distractions, get to more places. At the end of the day, 
Guys, dog training is simply this. Asking the dog what, what you want versus what you don't want, right? How do we teach the dog what we want through treats? How do we teach that what we don't want through withholding treats, through 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 ah uh -uh, through telling the dog nope that's not what I wanted, or the different tools that are out there? But here's the thing, guys: every tool needs to be mastered in and of itself. Like a carpenter has mastered a hammer. So when he goes to your house and he builds a, a wall or whatever, and it takes really short, you're like wow, that was awesome. I wish I could do that. You're gonna watch a YouTube video and it's not gonna be like that, right? It's because you guys need practice, you need consistency, and you wanna be able to learn from somebody that has done what you guys want. If you guys want a caliber of dog, look who that person has has trained, right? And ultimately it's like this, guys. How many people do you guys see that they're doing all these demos without any distractions? Not fireworks, not streets and buses and all this stuff. Within the quadrants of four walls or a training room or a couple other dogs or the same training room over and over, dogs are easily patterned. So just because a dog knows something somewhere, that doesn't mean that they know everything everywhere, right? So take your time. Enjoy the journey because it's a fun journey, but there's always something that comes up. And there's always like, you're learning, the dog is learning, you guys are both going through this journey together. You're figuring out why is this dog in my life? You know, hopefully most dogs are sold dogs, some aren't. But if you need help, then remember guys, I got the course out. I've been really busy, um, it's been, it's been so hard. The marketing aspect, the mobile application, over 60 videos, editing, whatever, like, you know, whether you guys are looking for the basics, learning how to do any trick possible, it's all in the course. It's 60 videos that you guys can do at your own pace. And you guys, you guys know that I break it down. There's no guesswork. You don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to worry if we're doing it the right way or the wrong way, because I give you different strategies that you can implement. So the mobile uh, or the iOS for the mobile app is coming out at the end of December, or I'm sorry, at the end of September. And um, at the end of September also, there's two courses. I'm gonna be doing a puppy course and also the e-collar course is coming out. That's gonna be a lot of fun. But if you guys need to get started, get started now with the in-home self-paced tutorial system that you guys can follow along with learn train yourself first train your dog and then you guys will be able to do the off leash and all types of other types of things but it all starts with that system there's so much in there guys it's guaranteed and you guys can ask for your money back it's guaranteed to be the best program that you guys have watched have trained under remember when i come in it's a lot of information at first with this i mean you guys can watch and re-watch and you guys have a mobile app too for now um and i'm probably gonna charge separately for it but for right now it's a really good way for you guys to tie it together and have something there coaching you through it whether it be alarms whether it be sharing your progress whether it's telling you what to do on every single day i got you covered if you guys haven't picked up the course, go ahead and do so. Remember we talked about knowing today and enjoying the ride, okay? Some more videos coming out soon. I'm going to Arizona, I'm going back. So if you guys uh, if you guys are in Arizona, if you guys want some training, definitely hit me up. Follow me on facebook.com forward slash masterpaw. That's also the same handle for Instagram. Instagram.com forward slash the masterpaw. And then the YouTube channel, of course, is youtube.com forward slash masterpaw, not the. So, hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you guys are training on. I have another cool video to show you guys in a couple days, maybe tomorrow, whatever. If you guys like this video, if you guys like Master Paw and you guys picked up the course, whatever, if you guys drop a comment below, like it, and if you haven't subscribed, do so because I'm gonna teach you guys some really cool things along this journey, which is gonna maximize your potential. My name's Adam with Master Paw, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks.